In this video, instead of talking about a new radio for you to spend your monies on, I have decided to save your monies by making a video about doing something with the radio that you already have. And the fact that there are no new radios on the market right now to make videos about in no way impacted this decision. And since my new best friend, Stephen Kilbreth 8419 left a comment on one of my videos just the other day about masking your full conversations over the air by making use of the little known TDR or dual watch function that most cheap Chinese radios have, I have decided to steal that idea and pretend that I thought it up all by myself because this is something that I have thought about many times in the past. Because if this worked, it would give you some privacy when talking on your two-way radio. Sort of. Because anyone listening would only be able to hear half of your conversation. Us radio experts refer to this as halfplex, which means being half secure. If you want full privacy and full encryption, you're going to have to buy yourself a much more expensive and far more difficult and confuculating to use radio. So let's see if this works instead. This little radio dork hack works on most GMRS radios, hams radios, UHF radios, and any radio that has a dual watch or TDR function. For you non-radio dorks, that means that you will need a radio that can listen to two channels or frequencies at the same time. The only caveat is that the two radios must be able to receive and transmit on at least some of the same frequencies. For example, this will not work with a UV5R and a CB radio because most CB radios cannot receive or transmit on any other frequencies that the UV5R can. And the UV5R can't receive or transmit on any of the frequencies that most CB radios can transmit or receive on. However, it will work with two GMRS radios or two HAMS radios and even a GMRS radio and an unlocked HAMS radios because they can both receive and transmit on congruent frequencies. I will discuss that more momentarily. And before you try this, it also helps to be familiar with your radio and all of its little buttons and functions. If you don't know how your radio works, then please go watch some of my other videos until you figure it out and then come back. And a disclaimer, as far as I know, doing this does not break any FCC rules or regulations based on my interpretation of said rules. However, if you think I'm wrong, please leave a comment and change my mind. There may be FCC rules saying that a hams radios can't transmit on GMRS frequencies or whatever, but nobody really cares about that. And of course, it goes without saying that you will need to be properly licensed to use whatever frequencies you will be transmitting on. So that no FCC agents raid your house at 3 a.m. and shoot your dog. The point here is that simply transmitting on one frequency and receiving on a different frequency probably does not violate any FCC regulations. But be sure to read through all of the comments to see what all of the experts and unemployed couch-based lawyers have to say about this. Anyway, this is all you need to do to prevent others from listening in on both sides of your radio conversations. First of all, you will have to pick two different frequencies or channels. It matters not what channels or frequencies they are, as long as both of your radios can transmit on them, and your radio does not even have to be able to transmit on both. But your radio will have to be able to transmit on one of them and at least be able to receive on the other frequency. You will then have to pre-share those two frequencies with your talking partner that you wish to conversate with. For this demonstration, I have chosen to use GMRS channel 19 and HAMS radio's frequency 446.550, my gigahertz. There's nothing special about those frequencies. I just pulled them out of my ass. After you have pre-shared the frequencies with your partner, you will then have to set up both radios. So as you can see, with your very own light collection pustules, I have before me two radios. This is a GMRS radio, so it can only transmit on GMRS frequencies, but it can also receive HAMS radios frequencies. And this is an unlocked HAMS radios. It can transmit and receive on both HAMS radios and 
GMRS frequencies. So first of all, I'm going to ensure that the TDR or dual watch option is enabled on both radios. Then on one radio, I'm going to set the top line channel to GMRS channel 19. which also happens to be 462.650 my gigahertz. Then I'm gonna set the lower channel to 446.550 my gigahertz. Thusly. Then I'm going to ensure that on this radio, the upper line channel will be set as my transmitting channel, which I will do by selecting the AB button. Now when I transmit on this radio, it will be transmitting on channel 19 or 462.650, my gigahertz. And because TDR or dual watch is enabled, it will also be listening on the lower line, which in this case is the previously agreed to frequency of 446.550, my gigahertz. Then on the hams radios, after I have already ensured that the TDR or dual watch option is enabled, I'm going to set the agreed to send and receive frequencies opposite of what I have on the other radio. So I'm going to set the upper channel at 446.550 my gigahertz, and I'm going to set the lower one at 462.650 my gigahertz, which in hams radios speak is GMRS channel 19. And I'm going to use the A, B button to ensure that the upper frequency is set as my transmit channel, as indicated by the little arrow thingy. And just like the other radio, because TDR or dual watch is enabled, it will also be listening on the lower frequency line, which is 462.650, which happens to be GMRS channel 19. And now this is where the magic happens. When I transmit on this radio on GMRS channel 19, this radio will hear it as you can see by the receive indicator. And when I transmit on that radio, which you will notice I am doing off camera because of reasons, that radio will hear it. However, anyone listening to either one of those frequencies is only going to hear half of the conversation because we are now transmitting in half plex, which means being half secure. And the only way someone will be able to listen to both sides of your conversation is if they scan through all the other channels until they hear your partner talking. So if you're using two GMRS radios, because you're limited to only 22 channels, that may not be too difficult to do. But if like in this demonstration that you have just observed, if one of those frequencies is not a GMRS frequency, they would have to scan through thousands of frequencies to be able to hear the other side of the conversation. Now, obviously, if you are plotting a terrorist attack or coordinating an unannounced visit to the Capitol in Washington, D.C., this would not be a very good method of concealing your communications. However, if you're just talking to your friends about the weather or what happened on yesterday's episode of Matlock or your upcoming doctor's visit, then this is plenty secure enough. You're welcome. <laughs>